Hi guys, what's up? <laughs> yes, I am in my pajamas and no, I do not care. I am so comfortable. I have a sunburn on my shoulders, so they need to breathe. I got aloe on them and needs to, you know, dry and bleh. I had an interesting day. I was very bored and feeling unproductive, so I did nothing. I went to the park to walk while I drank my cold brew that wasn't very good. I was very disappointed. And then I still felt like not doing anything, so I went to the mall and went shopping. Got some stuff from Urban Outfitters and what else did I do? Uh, Starbucks, I got Starbucks. Tried a peach green tea, it was very good. Oh, and I got Victoria's Secret. That's it. I always forget things I literally did an hour ago. But yeah, that is why I am now in my pajamas and it is 10 p.m. and I still have to film tomorrow's video, which is what I'm posting right now. <laughs> that is what happens when you procrastinate and you have to do things at the very last minute. I like to relax at night and watch my shows and play Animal Crossing and go on Pinterest and TikTok. So having to work right now is not fun, but it's fine, I'm in a good mood, so yeah. But yes, today we are looking at some more funny SpongeBob memes, part 24. So comment below your favorite SpongeBob character. And as always, please subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, links are all down below, and please like and share the video, thank you. And yeah, let's go. Teacher, why didn't you study? Uh, I've got a life. I literally don't care about this class. It's physics. I'm not gonna be a physician or a scientist, whatever they do. I'm not gonna try to solve the equation of the universe. I don't think about those things. I just live my life. I don't care about physics. Hold on, sorry, it is too hot in here. Gotta turn it down just a smidge. Okay, this is me not doing my work. Like, I have a life, man. I gotta do some shopping. I don't have time to work. <laughs> yeah, right. Call 403-244-5544. Ask, is this the Krusty Krab? I'll try that right now, bet. 403-244-5544. Let me turn it all the way up. Your call cannot be completed as dialed. Please check the number and dial again. It don't work. You suck. That's a number for Canada. Okay, don't call these random numbers, guys. Not a good idea. Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Whoever you are, I'm sorry I bothered you. Tell your wife I'm sorry for waking you up. <laughs> Me, goes to room because the family party is too loud. Little cousins, uh, hi, what you doing? You got games on your phone? You got snacks? Can I chill with you? You wanna play dinosaurs? <laughs> no, I don't. I was always the odd one out with my cousins. Like, they're cool. They were nice, but they're always hanging out with each other and not me. Yeah, fun childhood. <laughs> I just noticed this corgi has a butthole. That's nasty. Anyways, can I be excused for the rest of my life? Yeah, same Z's. Let's go get some fancy drinks, go get some coffee, get a lunch at Whole Foods, and just chill and vibe and talk about life and our auras and zodiac signs. Guys, it's okay to have days where you do nothing and you're not productive. You don't always have to be doing something. Just don't do it too much. Burger King launches red burger, sets sights on entire color spectrum. One, that looks nasty, but you know what this reminds me of? True fans, we understand. Comment below if you got it, I'll give you a second. And pretty patties, dude. They have pretty patties at Sugar Factory. It's a really fancy restaurant in LA. And they literally have pretty patties, but they call it something else. But when I first saw it, I was like, these are literally pretty patties. You plagiarizing liars. <laughs> when you're at a store and press a button on something and it starts beeping loudly, like, oops. <laughs> it's when you're an adult going through the toy aisle, look at all the toys your parents didn't buy you, and you start pressing buttons, and then they start making really loud noises, so you have to run away and act like you didn't do it and blame it on the little girl on, in the next aisle. SpongeBob can literally lift this giant glass of liquid, but can't lift marshmallows on a stick. Don't make no sense. <laughs> Top 10 questions science still can't answer. That is the perfect thumbnail for that video. 1.9 million views, wow. There are so many things wrong with SpongeBob, like things that are illogical, don't make sense, but guys, it's a cartoon. Don't try to make it make sense. <laughs> It's meant to entertain children. <laughs> Me, wakes up at 4 a.m. and your body is just so freaking thirsty. It's like, water! <laughs> I just sounded like the grudge just now. <laughs> but sometimes you don't feel like getting up to go get water. It's like, no, I just wanna go back to sleep. But you get even more thirsty. You have to drink something. That's why I always keep a water right next to my bed every night. Cause I always get thirsty. I drink water constantly so I don't get headaches. 
When your mom is yelling at you to do more chores while you're already doing chores and you're just there like, what do you want me to do, woman? I can't multitask like that. I can't do five things at once. I'm not the mom here. That's your job. I mean, yeah, help your parents around the house. You know, they birthed you, they're raising you, paying for your life. So it'd be nice if you did some laundry and dishes every now and then, but sometimes they get a little unreasonable. Like when you are about to clean your room and then they yell at you to clean your room, it's like, no, now I don't wanna do it. I was gonna do it myself, but you told me to, so now I can't. I have to sit here and do nothing. When you close your eyes to shampoo your hair, but then you think a demon is watching you, guys, it's not. I know the feeling, but you're fine. Demon ain't creeping on you in the shower. Demons aren't perverts, hopefully. So you open your eyes mid scrub, but there's no demon and now you're going blind because shampoo got in your eyes. <laughs> that is ugly. <laughs> He's not looking good. Guys, no demons watching you, I promise. I will watch over you. I'm not gonna watch you, that's gross, but I will protect you from demons and bad energy and whatnot. You know, me and Mrs. Corgi got you. When you check your phone and see 12 missed calls from mom. All right, get in, you're dead. I ain't going home, I'm just gonna die right now. That'd be better than going home to the wrath of mom and her missed calls. Did that happen to me once? Um, yeah. One time at the county fair, I ran off to go hang out with my friends and my mom couldn't find me. And she was looking for me for like an hour until I finally found her and she was so mad. When your download says it's 100% done, but it's still loading. That means something's wrong or you just need to wait a few seconds. I get such anxiety. I'm like, really? You're right at the finish line. You crossed it and now you're backtracking so someone else can win. No, we don't do that here. So SpongeBob lives in a circular pineapple, but the inside has corners. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. And he has so many rooms. Like, it's so big on the inside. It's like he's Batman. He has secret rooms, like, in the ground. This man lives in a pineapple under the sea and has a snail that meows. And you're concerned with the architectural accuracy of his home, like everything else makes perfect sense? No, they literally have fire underwater. Don't try. And he has a dead fish on his wall. Oh my God, SpongeBob's a murderer. I just noticed that. Hello. How I look at the menu, even though I'm going to get the same thing as usual, you know what? I wanna see if there's any new options. I might be feeling spicy today. Might get the chicken tacos instead of the shrimp tacos. I might get Caesar salad instead of mashed potatoes. Unlikely, but maybe. How the heck does Santa know if we're naughty or nice, but he didn't even know Rudolph was getting bullied? That's none of my business. <laughs> he picks and chooses. Me throwing some fake positivity on my bad mood. <laughs> like I'm trying to force myself to get in a good mood to film sometimes, cause sometimes I have a bad day, I'm crying and I'm like, crap. I have to film like five videos right now, but I can't stop crying. So I try to fix it, try to fake myself into a good mood. Sometimes it works, but sometimes I just can't. I'm a very emotional person. I'm an emotional wreck. Freshman with a paper due in two weeks. Guys, chill. You can get it done in literally one night, maybe two tops. And seniors, when they have a paper due in two hours, they are just chilling. They don't care. I finished an entire essay. It was two pages in 40 minutes. It was due that day and the teacher gave us the class period to finish it and turn it in. I started the minute I sat down in that class and I did it and I got like a B minus on it. Heck yeah, proud of myself. You ask your mom for fast food and she says yes and ask what you want. Whose mom says yes, please tell me. I don't know, I didn't think I'd get this far. I, what are the options? <laughs> I don't wanna make her mad and ask for too much. But you also don't wanna pass up this opportunity and get something you don't love. So, McDonald's or Chick-fil-A. Hopefully it's not Sunday. What happened here? Obviously, it's me millionth dollar. <laughs> it's Mr. Krabs, him and his stupid dollar. My favorite graduation cap in 2018. Goodbye everyone, I'll remember you all in therapy. <laughs> Uh, heck no, I ain't remembering jack squat. I am erasing you from my brain. You're going into the deepest, darkest corner of my skull and I am locking you up, turning off the lights and burying the key in the dumpster and then throwing it in space. I won't remember any of you, bye. But yeah, that is it for funny SpongeBob memes part 24. <laughs> Yay! And it's not even 10.30. I still have plenty of the night left to edit and still check on my Animal Crossing Island. Yay. Again, please subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Links are all down below. And please like and share the video. Thank you. I'm sorry. 
Oh, and try boxed water, guys. This brand of boxed water literally tastes like really good water. It doesn't taste like it's in a box like they normally do. And this isn't sponsored. I'm literally just telling you, save the planet and drink this water. It's so good. But yeah, whatever. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.